Hi Scorpio, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and get into this Scorpio. Thank you God for blessing Scorpio with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so this week you have the Wheel of Fortune. All right. You have the Eight of Swords as the advice. And you have the Seven of Pentacles as the outcome. So it looks like somebody's clingy. And maybe you, you want to take some time away. You want to get away. There's a masculine energy who doesn't want to be in a full-on commitment or, you know, a relationship to where they feel stuck, trapped, or just bound, or like they have no way out. Somebody's also creating the environment like where they want to kind of trap somebody. This could be, I don't know, trap somebody in any way. Trap somebody with a baby. Trap somebody with, you know, an ob a lot of obligation. But there's a masculine energy that's like, um, yeah, this this might need to come to an end or has already come to an end. Now, ma the masculine energy could be a man or a woman. It's just whoever is coming up is more, you know, take charge, has the ideas, you know, more so... Um, more dominant okay um it seems as if uh somebody feels like somebody's suffocating or the relationship is suffocating them somebody feels like they go around in the same situation with this person or, or some masculine energy it's like there's always an issue it's like they don't know how to get away from the fact that it's always an issue there's somebody's never happy somebody's never satisfied um they're always overthinking things they're always up in their head there's always an argument and somebody's realizing that this is how this person has always been the outcome says that maybe like you guys will take a break from each other just so maybe the both of you can realize what it is you have it doesn't feel like you think that the relationship is over. It just need, it just more so needs need a break. You know, you need a break, um, because it looks like you're going to persevere through this and try to get through it. Yeah, somebody's going to try to get through this, even though they're frustrated. They're frustrated with the relationship. They're frustrated with communication. They're frustrated with how overbearing somebody is or how uh, dominant they try to be. Somebody feels like they're stuck in some situation, stuck in some relationship when they're really not. They just need to think this over. Some blessing could come in due time or, or things will change in due time. Somebody will get over this. I think if a relationship has ended, it's still new, newly, you know, newly divorced or a relationship has newly you know, ended and um, somebody's just not ready for it to be over and they're not ready to deal with it. They're still trying to hold on. Someone's still trying to work on this relationship with occupation here. And then at the bottom of the deck, you have courtship. So it's like somebody's still trying to work on this relationship. They're really trying to put a lot of effort into this. They're also waiting for things to turn over and turn around. It's like somebody's very abrasive. You know, they want to be the boss of everything and everybody. It's hard to deal with them. You know, but somebody's realizing that it, it's always been this way. Somebody's going to, the relationship, the situation is getting to a boiling point where somebody's going to kind of like have an outburst or it already happened. It could be you, Scorpio. Yeah, it could be you. Um, and all of a sudden you guys could, if you were apart from this person, and all of a sudden you could reconcile and the reconciliation could be um it, because there's like a codependent relationship and it could be sexual also you could be married to this person or, or want to marry this person somebody feels like this is this one could be like a spiritual marriage though you guys will try to get over whatever is holding you back um so that's a good thing uh, but right now it's like somebody feels very frustrated claustrophobic i don't know they feel like somebody's too clingy um where it, they're creating a, a boundary they're isolating them 
this is what I have for you, Scorpio. If it resonates for you, go over to the website, book your reading there. Also find me live here every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, you can ask questions. You can just come for the collective reading. You can also get your own uh, reading by going to the website. You could donate to the channel by clicking the buy L or coffee link. Thank you guys. Many blessings to you. Take care.